people don't come just to see Craig. They come to see all of Craig's world. And his friend JP is a fan favorite character. I've dared JP to eat all kinds of junk I found on the ground. I'm glad to know that all that barfing was for a good cause. Me and my friend Craig will be trying powdered fist straws. Woo, pungent. Would you mind sticking me on a flight to Flavortown? Hot cabbage and clams. Oh, it smells like a nursing home by the docks. I thought hot cabbage meant spicy, but it's more like cabbage that's been sitting in the back of a car. Hey, I bought it with so much mud on it that I can't read what's inside. Let's roll the dice, you guys. Ah. Uh, <coughs> Grass isn't food, man. My mom and the eight doctor appointments I've had made that very clear. Red velvet chocolate rolls? This stuff tastes like dirt. That, that is dirt. Eat the red stuff. Oh my gosh, that's the most delicious thing I've ever tasted. It's the rest of the pie, bitch, knocked on the floor. Uh, is there cat hair in it? You allergic to cats? No, I, I eat cat hair all the time. Mm. The cat hair adds a saltiness. I shouldn't ask, but what's in a radiant sandwich? The ultimate power! And mayo. This isn't your fault, it's just kind of a pet peeve of mine, but you don't need other ingredients if you have mayo. Mayo is the sandwich. Good day! I smell maple syrup. I wonder, what did you have for breakfast? Cereal with syrup! Sometimes I substitute syrup for milk because I like the crunchy feeling of cereal, but also the sweet woody taste of pancakes! We can't afford to lose a single piece. I think I ate one. What? I was just going to town on these delicious cube-shaped candies, and I guess I mixed them up. Oh, false alarm! Definitely just a candy. <laughs> I want a milky. You can't afford a milky. Aw. I'll just take, like, 12 coffee creamers then. What do you want? We would like a refill on our unlimited salad, please. What? You haven't even finished that one yet. We ate all the olives, and that is the part we like. Bread sticks! Bread sticks! Bread sticks! Bread sticks! Here are your bread sticks. Yeah! <laughs> I don't feel so great about this. Oh, I'm not, I'm not feeling too great either. Bread sticks are pushing in many directions in my body. Wait! 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 Oh. Wait. Oh. You guys go on without me. I think those bottomless breadsticks found a bottom. PBNJ sans crust. Mm. I think my tongue is crying. I'm actually crying. Behold, a snack with the sugary density of a chocolate roll to the 15th power. The sucrose collider. Good tongue feel. <laughs> I want to do a dramatic fake out, but I can't. This was a really great snack! Ooh. What are these? I, I call them Craig Spideys. Yeah, Craig, it is Craig, isn't it? Aren't spiders supposed to have eight legs? Crutcherella sticks. Mm. Oh, so cheesy, but so spicy. Yeah, this is a two for one deal if I ever seen one. Witness the absolute perfection of my Gretzicle. <laughs> Whoa, like and subscribe. This trail of sandwiches will lead the fair right to our trap. Now, all we do is wait. You know, I, I, I've never actually tried pastrami. <laughs> Me neither. A little nibble couldn't hurt, right? <laughs> Maybe I should try it. You know, just like a little bite. Oh. Oh. I can't believe we ate the whole trail. Wow, it's so cheesy. You got that right, James Pajamas. I use four types of cheese. Cream, goat, mimolette, and gruyere. And of course, my special ingredient, blackberries. Aw, uh, no thank you. <sighs> I guess I'll go and make y'all some regular grilled cheese. Yay! Let me know what you think in the comments below. Or don't. I don't base my happiness on the opinions of others. All right, I'll catch you on the next one. No one can resist the allure of fashion. Oh my gosh, I, I never won anything like this before. Am I crying? It is I, John Paul, dressed toe to tip in his very dashing Sunday suit. 
This look says I'm ready to chaperone your school dance or finally ask out Barbara from the PTA meetings. Should I get this fake mustache or this comb? I mean, a little bit of both. I give this crowd eight belly freckles out of 10. Snazzy. JP's fine Creek Boutique bracelets are very fashionable, if I do say so myself. That's flashy and fashionable, by the way. Duct tape can fix anything. 80% of JP's pants are duct tape at this point. I cannot take them off. It's gorgeous. I just want like a little sparkle. Check out my pants. I chopped them. So I got that breezy leg look. So guys, what do you think? Look how like how it cinches. It really says JP's got a waist. I can either see or breathe in this mask. Well, which one's more important? Something's coming. Oh, see what it is. <gasps> JP! <gasps> Oh, I gotta learn how to breathe through my nose. I found something else to add some shine to my bracelets. Gummies! Hey, you quit eating my bracelets! Get, 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 get. You don't have an iconic accessory! Oh, have I not introduced you to my oversized sleeves? Stick out your arms like you got long sleeves. Wave them around, just like me. Don't be shy, just get funky and do the JP. Am I more of a coral or a ruby red? It's tricky because there's a lot of orange in my outfit. I'm here to tell you what's cool and what's not cool. Vertical stripes are cool. Horizontal stripes are not cool! Can't switch to vertical stripes. They make me look taller than I already am. I reject Eliza's fashion advice. Horizontal stripes are cool. Yeah, they are! I made fashion. Ooh, la la. Great, now I'm bald again. Ah! JP! I got my underwear wet. Oh, it's conforming to all my contours. Whoa, whoa. Ow. Mom and I just cleaned the house yesterday. There's no way I'm letting you inside wearing those wet clothes. All right, well, then I won't wear them. JP, no. You can't just get in the buff out here in the open. JP, where is your shirt? Oh, a brownie monster took it. Uh, uh, I can't reach it. JP, I'm going to need... Way ahead of you. I'll knock it down with my shoe. Uh, oops. Nope. 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 Well, I ran out of things to throw. All we need is a sale. JP, give me your jersey. You don't gotta ask me twice. It's working! Duh! Oh no, my iconic accessory! Oh! <laughs> So JP lost his shirt again? Feel like that boy never has clothes on. Ah! Ah, look away, Mortimer! JP, you saved our lives. We are forever in your debt. Oh, hey, Laura! John Paul, don't you dare tell me you went out in your birthday suit again. Nah, I wore my Sunday suit. You did what? But don't worry, I didn't get nothing dirty. <laughs> Very responsible, JP. Somebody put some clothes on that boy! Back off, Carol! Why are you guys hanging on the fence? Come on, hit the ice with me! Just grab my sleeves and hold on tight. Here we go! Hey, did you guys hear something rip? JP, it's okay. Your arms are fine. It's just your sleeves that got ripped off. Why couldn't they have ripped my arms off instead? That jersey really meant a lot to you, huh, JP? Yeah, it was way too big for me when Dad bought it. But I was supposed to grow into it and wear it at my graduation. And then to my wedding. And then later when I head towards the light. Your dad is going to send you a brand new jersey. My new jersey? It's a blue jersey? It's the wrong color. And what's with this nine on the back? My name is JP. That'll be confusing for my brand. JP. Oh, there you are. <laughs> you got another package in the mail. I wonder what could be inside. No way. It's my jersey. How's it look? JP, just perfect. JP, you have a glue bottle stuck to the side of your head. Huh? telling y'all, I'm here for comic relief. Okay, first impression is everything. My name is JP and I love you and you love me too. Oh man, that's way too much. 
Remember when we found JP? I was surrounded by spikes and fire. Oh, 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 spike! Oh, oh. Fire! I was surrounded by spikes and fire! Oh no! Are you okay? I found seven new joints in my body. Before you ask, we already went to the doctor and they said it's uncurable. Do a backflip. All right. <laughs> JP, are you sure you can lift all three of us? It's okay. I eat my sandwich crust so my body's extra fortified. Didn't there used to be a hole here? Oh, here it is. <laughs> Come on, y'all. <laughs> oh, it seems a lot smaller. <laughs> oh, okay. Guys, I think I grew. Which of you is going to challenge me next? Oh, don't look at me. My eyes aren't even fully formed yet. No eye whites. <laughs> It's a problem, I can't see a lot of colors. The Ninja Garden Waterfall! I'm an alien, remember? I can't get hurt. <gasps> Go home, JP. Ow! <coughs> Eat my tuna! It's delicious! It's been in my underwear. <laughs> I never noticed this grouping of belly freckles. Oh man, you should see my butt. I had the craziest pudding craving. I must have eaten like four cups. Yeah, me too, but I only had my mom's digestive yogurt in the fridge, so I am barely holding it together, you guys. With some duct tape, we'll be able to keep water out of the stump. No more soggy mess. Yeah, no more trench foot. That ghost is gonna keep haunting you until they get what they want. Just like ringworm. I brought Ice Pops! Um, I think they melted. Oh no. Oh, not the ice cream too! We were looking for a lost and found? <laughs> I thought we were looking for a bathroom. <laughs> I'll be right back. <clears throat> Off to the bush, buddy! Hey, you guys, I found something! It's a fossil! Yep, and I found it in the most incredible way, digging a hole to poop in, which I just remembered I still need to do. Wow. That was fun, but it gave me a real big wedgie. Sometimes I feel like I am the only sophisticated one around here. Oh man, dance mat. The perfect stage for some freestyle Vogue. <clears throat> working time or oh, working time. Make minimum wage, but I'm feeling just fine. Hey, where are you off to, double shirt? Oh, I'm just covering a shift for Elder Market, Digital City. JP! Hey, Mr. Cole, want to use my employee discount? I'm gonna go up to Roper. There could be a cloud kingdom filled with giants. If there's giants, then I'll finally get to be the shortest person for a change. I'll be like, hey, how's the weather up there for you? So your dad wants us to order dinner alone? Nobody takes orders from kids. But what if we don't sound like kids? Good evening, ma'am. I require an order of pet CU with chicken. And a side of rice. Children, please, I'm on the phone. <laughs> Takeout's fine. Bye. I love you. Oh. Nobody spins the lollipop wheel like Big Daddy JP. I don't know why I called myself that. Are you three interested in joining our little soiree? They don't just give these out to anybody. I wonder why we got one. Oh, uh, probably by mistake. I get invited to a lot of things that way and then promptly asked to leave. It looks like I left my backpack open. Looks got a little soggy. We should probably put these in some rice. See you never, textbooks. Uh, you do know you're supposed to return those to the school, right? I said see you never. I bet the future has way cooler stuff. Like me, I'm, I'm still around, right? I come from over a thousand years in the future. So am I like bald? There's a bunch of pill bugs. I call those roly polies. I call them little dirt biscuits. Half the kids here don't even come to the creek with a full battery. Like, I'm at 10% right now. Like, oh, I, I can't waste that on checking the time. What if, what if I see something funny I want to take a picture of? Like a snake in a little wig. Oh, my lips are so dry. I'll have your lips healed in no time. Whoa. Doesn't that feel cute? <laughs> Hiya! Oh, he's some sort of metal man! Never mind, new information has come to light! Someone help me! I've been stuck up here for hours! Are you trying to kiss a squirrel? What? No! I mean, wait, yeah, no! You gotta get me out of here! I gotcha, I gotcha! <clears throat> Don't worry, you'll kiss that squirrel someday. Not so easy being the comic relief now, is it?
Can I wing it? I'm usually at my best just winging things. <laughs> JP, I honestly never know what you're gonna say. I have an internal logic. If I was stuck on a deserted island and could only bring one thing, it would be choco rolls. I bring a fake mustache. If I'm on a deserted island, it's probably because I'm on the run. You know, after jumping off a cruise ship. Huh? Why would you have to jump off a cruise ship? Well, obviously, the chef overheard me badmouthing the lobster bisque. So he chased me around with a cleaver and I jumped overboard. And now I'm on the run from an upset chef and a talking crab who's after my doubloons. Doubloons? Pirate money. Yar! I prefer movies where the owners don't think the dogs are coming back, but then they do. I think I really need to pull my life together. What do you mean? Well, like the other day, I fell asleep while riding my bike and I ran to a lamppost. I, I just, I wasn't listening to my body. Like I should have pulled over and taken a nap in the driveway. Duh, man, that thing is really wedged in there. Ooh, I got an idea. If we hum together at the right frequency, we should be able to break the rocks and get the bottle. Okay, all right, come on, here we go. Hum. Give me a craggy cranium. You want to match my head? That's so sweet. Of course I want to match my bestie. So in 30 years, long after we've fallen out of touch, we'll both be walking down the street and pass by each other and say, same head? Same, same head. head! Same head! Same head! Same head. Ugh, traffic's so thick. Guess it's podcast time. Welcome to JP's podcast, brought to you by Website Maker. Website Maker. With Website Maker's easy to use layouts, you're gonna be like, okay, I just did a website. That wasn't hard. Oh, do you have a frog in your throat? And if so, why did you eat it? And more importantly, do you have any more? <gasps> You've been jinxed. Jinx? Oh, like when you wake up and your leg's asleep and you're worried it's gonna be like that forever, but then you get pins and needles and it's fine. What? There's more where these came from if you take me up the creek. What do you say? Yo-ho! A chance to sail the open seas. My cowlicks blowing in the breeze. My sea legs damp up to the knees. Yay, count me in if you do please. Did you just like make that up on the spot? Oh no, I wrote that a couple weeks ago. It's weirdly appropriate for this situation, right? So it's scurvy? Well, Kelsey, when a child stops dreaming, a fairy cries, and if the tear goes in your mouth, you get a parasite that eats your teeth. Neat! Judging by these three chairs, it seems like there were three kids that hung out here. I think they were a highly advanced civilization. Looking to communicate with intelligent life to unlock the mysteries of the universe. Or talk to a bunch of lonely truckers. Breaker, breaker, one nine. Anyone got their ears on? I got a smoky on my bumpy and I'm looking for my glasses. Guys, I've fallen through the soft, flaky crust of the earth. The worms have finally had enough of us walking on their roof. Y'all need to save yourselves before it's too late. Still no sign of Kelsey. Or the beast. Maybe she already defeated it. Or it defeated her. Or they defeated each other at the same time. Or, or, or he became friends and moved away from the creek to the Big Apple where they found a really nice apartment in like Soho. Ah! Man, people need to be careful about where they leave their snow. Hey, I like your jersey. I wonder what's your favorite sport. Hockey? Not applicable. I find competitive sports divisive. What's two plus two equal? Four. Three plus one. You're so hard to predict, I never know! What you're you gonna say? JP, they said not to touch anything. Oh, I'm sorry. Staring at that waterfall. It, it reminded me of art class. <laughs> Getting glue on my fingers and trying to peel it off. Trying to what? Ugh, the glue finished hardening. Uh, uh, there's nobody like you. Because you're special. And the way your brain works is very cool. 